I'm James Pugsley McDermott, and I'm the front house engineer for Dirks Bentley. I chose PK to move into what I consider to be the cutting edge of PA technology. It does exactly what you're telling it to do on the console. Being able to grab an EQ or push a fader and have that response immediately it becomes very tactile for me as an engineer that I get that response and it drives the mix even further for me and it becomes, the power that comes from that uh, is very appetizing. We were on tour in Calgary through Canada in the wintertime and had an opportunity to go and check out PK's facilities and operation. And when I actually got my hands on it and got a chance to see what it does and what it can do and how it sounds, I was really impressed. What PK is doing is they have discovered that they can fix a lot of the issues uh, in regards to horizontal and vertical coverage mechanically as opposed to fixing them uh, via DSP. As we get more and more into these heavily DSP'd rigs, I find that they color the mix to the point that I don't really care for it. After listening to a couple of tracks uh, at the PK facility, it didn't take very long for me to realize that not only does this thing have some incredibly cool physical attributes, but it sounded really good too. It sounds very transparent, very powerful, and it has something that I think that a lot of line arrays are really missing these days, and that is the good old fashioned punch that older systems had that we kind of stepped away from uh, with modern line arrays. 